Look, it's Jenna, it's Alan, it's Brandon, and Haley still dancing in our dancing after party because it's just getting started. We've got dancers from the Dancing with the Stars trip live, light up the night tour. They're all going to be on tour, and you guys have to go see them because they're coming to the town. This is the way to start the morning. A little bit of energy. Robin and everybody. <laughs> you still got it, Ginger. You still got it. Yes. Yes, yes. We're here now with the finalists of Dancing with the Stars season 25. Finale ever. The finalists flew all night to be here. We've got the winners, Jordan Fisher and Lindsay Arnold. <laughs> Drew Scott and Emma, Emma Swain are so wonderful. To have. All right, now. People do not realize what goes into these last 10 weeks the late nights, the early mornings. But you're going to miss it, right? Oh, yeah, 100%. Yeah. yeah. It's self torture. I mean, uh, we, <laughs> the long hours, I dropped 34 pounds and yes. aching everywhere, bruises everywhere, right, guys? It's but then tomorrow I'll be really like, can I still do a rehearsal? Pounds. Yeah. Yeah. Did. Yeah. 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 yeah, it's yeah. nuts. You can tell Jonathan and I part now, so. Uh. <laughs> and, and, and Jordan, for you, you've been a front runner basically since the oh, show man. started. Now it's over. You've won the trophy. Is there a sense of relief? Man. Uh, it's funny just kind of being back here and being with you guys, being on this floor and being with all of you. There's the, the, the naivete of the child that, that you once were before you start mm. the rehearsal process for the show. <laughs> it is rigged. So Dancing with the Stars made us. you a man? Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> putting in all the work and the time and the blood and the sweat and the tears and, and to be rewarded for that, especially with somebody that's so deserving. It's, it, it's been the most amazing process. I would do it all over again tomorrow. Mm. Wow. Look, this is your sixth season, yes. first year of the ball. When did you know you had the spark with Jordan? Well, immediately day one, we both felt it. We immediately became friends and that to me is the most important thing. But the thing that excited me the most about Jordan is week after week, I expected a lot from him and he always delivered. Never once, he's probably the only partner I've ever had that never said he couldn't do something. Mm. He always went for it and I asked a lot of him and he <laughs> never said no and I appreciate that because I was able to do things this season that I never thought I could do. So I'm very grateful. He, he went for it, you said, like it, singing as well. And I, I'm with Lindsay, is, make us feel better. Is there something you cannot do? <laughs> <laughs> make us feel better. It's so funny. My girlfriend and I, but we, we'll, we'll play ping pong or anything along those lines. If, if somebody else plays me, she roots for the, the other person. She's, <laughs> <laughs> she's like, it's all love, it's all love. And it was great singing. Thank you. It was. Great well, singing. And, and Lindsay, this was the first time we saw you during your freestyle with your violin yes. in the ballroom. That was really fun because it was something that actually when Mark and I first met, I was on stage at a sound check and he goes, I have an idea. And he like, you know, and it was an idea that we'd kind of been stewing over and um, it was really fun. I felt like I was given my little superpower secret weapon in the middle Ooh. of that dance mm. when they handed me that violin. That's my that's my passion, that's my comfort zone, and it, it made it really special to do that. It was a great, that was a great performance. Oh, thank you. And, and Mark, you took, a, you took a little time off, you took a year yeah. off. But yeah. you came back, your choreography was as inventive as mm. ever. Mm. And, and yeah. So, where, where does the inspiration come from? Um, for me, it's all about the music, really, and also um, my partner, uh, Lindsay, inspired me every day. She never told me that she couldn't do something either and was, you know, I've got quite an out-of-the-box mind and usually when I <laughs> share my ideas, people are like, huh? But she was like, I'm down, so that just made it that much easier and um, it was truly an honor and she inspired me every day and I'm very proud of her. Wait. Thank you. I remember you were so game from your first yeah. day here. Look, oh, yeah. you were excited about the whole season. <laughs> yeah. And we have a special message from you, from your Malcolm in the Middle mom. Oh, wow. Take one. <laughs> Makes me so happy to say congratulations and way to go. And I always knew you were a great dancer because remember that episode we did about um, the ABBA thing with uh, Mamma Mia? And you were such a good dancer, and I thought you should be in a boy band or something. <laughs>
Well, you've had the career that you've had. We, we dug up a little dancing video of oh, you from no. Malcolm in the Middle. Yes, we did. Oh, please. Give it, give it to him. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Now you can see from that video, Whitney, it looks like you really improved his, his dance. Moves. I hope so. I hope so from that. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. That's funny. He still has those same moves. Every time, every time the music comes on, that's what he goes to. Uh, so Drew, um, is there a dancing move that you could use in your upcoming wedding that you can share oh, with us? Oh, I mean, I'm going to mash up. I mean, I'm here. Come but on you can here. just. I, I, <laughs> Everybody. Oh, I love it. He's like, some, just something a little simple. Yeah, something else. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be the best first dance ever. I, I can't wait. But I, I've actually roped in Emma and her fiance. Yeah. They're going to teach Linda oh. and me some moves. So. Yeah. But, something else, though, but something else Emma has taught you is dancing and also how to spray tan. And yeah. So when this is all said and done, which one are you going to hold on to, the spray tanning or the dancing? Uh, oh, gosh. They're both so important You're in my life. Right? <laughs> uh, there's enough blackmail material out there on social media of my spray tan when she gave me the first one. Uh, Mark was even there when I had it done. <laughs> oh, God, you have to put it. No. Oh, it my was, uh, God. It was bad. It was bad. I think now that the show is over, yeah. I think now that the show is over, he can go back to being see-through again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my legs loosen ways. These legs. <laughs> We're blinded Jeez. by the light. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is what you all brought into our homes each and every week, and we thank you for that. Yeah. <laughs> well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.